All right, so here we are, Genesis. First piece of intel, right after you come out of there, get in the tank. It's right here by this ghost. Dead, gu dead grunt. So I've been thinking, if this place is supposed to be all perfect and made for us, how come nothing looks right? Where's the salty box, huh? Where's the methane springs? I mean, we can't even breathe over here. Not even the elites like it. I mean, who was this paradise made for, huh? I got no clue. <laughs> Uh, all right, next two sets are going to be in this area, right where you can see you're about to go into the temple there, or whatever you want to call it. First one is back this way. The final adventure of a particular grunt that we've been following since the beginning. Poor Kit Pitlin. So the next piece of intel is up there just a ways. So we'll just climb on up. These are Artemis tracking system just to make sure. That's always good to double check. And yes, there you go. Ooh, damage constructor. All right, our next bit of intel right after you come out of those doors here is actually right up there on the pelican. Marine Selena Ronan here. Our last known location was circling the Guardian at Samaron. There was a sequence of shockwaves and then, then we were here, wherever here is. Our pelican slip spaced in and came under immediate fire. Not many survivors. We'll try to find shelter and gather some supplies from the wreckage. This is a nightmare. Over. So for intel number four, we're not too far from the pelicans, right back there. And normally you'll go up this way, either through there or over the bridge. But if you go off to the left here, just a ways... Find the next chapter in the saga of our forerunner. Designation Genesis. How? Where is Bastion? Alright, for our next piece of intel, you can see that's the bridge we were just looking at a moment ago. This is the battle area you'll come to right after. Now if you go right up about there, and sit very almost just slightly see. The next piece of intel, so that might not be the best place to get on. So, ah, here we go. Better place. Much better place. Communications few. Constructed network picking up echoes. Confusing. For our next piece of intel, we're, as you can see, we're not too far away from that bridge. Just about to go over the ridge here, and if you just come up this way, just a bit, right there, not too far from a Spartan laser, is the data pad. Marie Gulas reporting in. So far, all we know about this planet is that it has hostiles. We've spotted Covenant. They probably got pulled along accidentally, same as us. We're holed up and maintaining a defensive perimeter. But the Calvies get aggressive when they're confused, and we're low on ammo. I don't know how long we can hold on. For our next two pieces of intel, this is the area where you'll fight the Warden again. Well, for the first time on this level, but uh, again in general. So if you come up here, right next to this elite body up here, next to an energy sword, more accurately, 
Yeah, our next piece of intel. Sounds like a Klingon. The other one is go the other way past that hu dead hunter. Sorry. Ah, there you go. Right through this right through this small passageway. Up, up, up the hills we go. And then right here. Reporting again. Just had to change location. Those robot things came after us hard. We went through the hills and could see Covenant ships getting slip spaced in and crashing all over the place. For now, we're bunkered by some structure. Started moving a little while ago. Don't know why. Don't know if we'd be safer nearby or if we should get away from it. Don't know much. Over. All right, so for our last piece of intel for this level this is the area where you take on the two Warden Eternals. If you just go up to the left here, right in that corner, you can kind of see it from here. Our final piece of intel and the next entry in our Forerunners Saga.